welcome to your first ever virgin experience on the movie movie game. How you feeling? <laughs> I'm feeling okay, Joe. I've watched this happen to so many people over the years, and I can't wait to have it happen to me. I think you're going to have a, a more of a leg up than you think, which is good. Uh, I I mean that's terrible news. I <laughs> I need you to I need you to lower everyone's expectations first. I expect a hundred percent. Um, the bar has been set over 14 years of internet creation. You're not allowed to fail. Oh, God. Hello, everybody. Welcome to the Sci-Fi Movie Movie Game. It's like the previous movie movie games that we did before, but with sci-fi. Here's what we do. We take a movie synopsis, we slam it together with another synopsis, and then I say that to the contestants, and they got to give me the slam together movie title. Here we go. Let's do it. My friends, how are you doing today? Feeling good, feeling spacey. We're good. We're shades of orange. Dude, you are you are a movie movie game virgin, as they say. I, yes, I am. I am. Question one, what is your how confident are you about your movie knowledge? Uh pretty low. Like not only am do like I haven't seen that many movies and also I don't have great access to my memories. I think I'm uh one of the best uh oh, at movie damn. cinema. Yeah, yeah. It's really worthless. This information that I have. Uh, then let me uh, let me let me turn it on you. Then I'll give you a little twist. How do you feel about sci-fi movies? I like sci-fi movies, and I pr I may do better at sci-fi movies than not sci-fi movies. Can I ask? Is that a sci sci-fi movie and then a movie, or two sci-fi movies? Uh, well, it could it could definitely fall into both categories, Great. but for sure. It is one sci-fi movie, sci movie and then another one. Gotcha. Did you know it was sci-fi movie game? No, I didn't, but I'm very excited, Joe. You know I'm a big sci-fi head myself. Let's do it. I can't. I hope we get three into this one, and then we start arguing over what sci-fi is. You know? <laughs> <laughs> I was That's actually I worried about that. 100%. I was like, okay, people are going to be assholes. Yeah. Miss Congeniality falls victim to some rowdy space debris, and she survives with some quick thinking and a little help from a wrinkle rocker sporting a bulbous bioluminescent fingertip and a peanut butter loving sweet tooth. Okay. Is. <laughs> I have the first one. I got the first one. Yeah, I got him. I think I have one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's that movie called? Hold on, don't say anything. Uh. Uh. <laughs> she's out in space alone. Yeah. Is it stupid to say? Is it gonna sound stupid when I say it? Yeah, they always do. <laughs> yeah, for sure. <laughs> like 100%. What is it? I keep wanting to say arrival. What's it called? Hold on, hold on, hold on. The E.T. E.T. Interstellar is that other f***ing space movie. <laughs> it's just, it's just, it's just a, 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 a colorful way. This, this is an a flowery way. way. All right. All right. You ready? Three. <laughs> Gravity T. Yes. <laughs> Gravity T. Yeah! <laughs> one for one, baby. <laughs> Gravity T. Extraterrestrial. <laughs> yeah, buddy. Gravity, Gravity T. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Gravity T. Colon. <laughs> The extraterrestrial. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> there, there he is. There he yeah. is. Coming in hot, dude. <laughs> dude, connection's getting bad. Just get out while you're 100%. Go. <laughs> That's a great, great combination of titles, Joe. Gravity T. <laughs> it doesn't feel right any time no. you say it. it. It was one of those things where I thought it mm -hmm. because of the finger, but yeah. then I was like, but that's so f***ing dumb to say. <laughs> I, it's so good, Joe. It's so genius. I don't know how you're not a millionaire yet. <laughs> oh, well, that's because I'm bad at this stuff. Hold him up. Obviously being weighed down by Earth's gravity. He is not from a planet that is from that that experiences this type of pull. Oh. And that's why he looks like that. Maybe that's why he's all squished down and has Yeah, all dude. Squ what yeah. if he's actually like six feet tall? <laughs> <laughs> like his legs are really long. Yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> I'll get into character for this guy. Okay. 
You Bojo! Those boards don't work on water, unless you got power! Or a monolith first encountered by pre-homo sapien species that eventually sends you on a perilous mission to Jupiter where you see yourself match wits with a jerk of a computer. Okay, got it. Oh, that's the first one. It's it's <laughs> a sequel. On one. It's a sequel. <laughs> it's a sequel, and I mean he just I, honestly he, it's Joe. It's classic oh. Joe again. He's taken. Okay, and we okay. have the full cake, but all he's taken is a slice of the icing. Is it Back to the Future too? Yeah. Oh, okay, okay, okay. But okay. it's there's it's mm, uh. back. It's Back to the Future too. Yeah. So, okay. okay. All right. Okay, so, I got it. I got all right. it. That's what I thought, but he the performance kind of threw me off. Again, he's he's pulling from just the <laughs> a sliver of the film, okay, okay. and all it has to offer. It's raining, Joe. I know it's so nice. It's great. Um, Pouring yesterday here. Oh, it was so nice in the evening. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah, the doors open. It's great, but you can't I've, have doors open because you have raccoons and coyotes now. <laughs> <laughs> Back to the Future 2001, A Space Odyssey. Yep, 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 yep. <laughs> Back to the Future 2. I mean, it's got to be like T-O. It's got to be like to the... Okay. All right, ready? Yes. Back, Back to, to the, the Future, future two, part, part 2, 2001, A Space Odyssey. Odyssey. Yeah! <laughs> Back to the Future 2001, A Space Odyssey. And if I said that jerk of a computer, his name was Hal, would that help? No, it wouldn't. It would not help at all, Joe. Back to the Future. (laughs) Back to the Future 2001 A Space Odyssey? Yeah, that's two for two, baby! (laughs) Okay, now I am going to stop. I can stop. I can just. You know when he says, you bojo? You bojo? Yeah. He's, He's saying bojo. Yeah. Like Not bozo. bozo. Like bozo. But saying, bojo. But saying bojo. Yeah, like some which, kind of future slang. Um, um, Kubrick. Yeah. Stanley. Back to the Future 2. Oh, it's going to be a big one, isn't it? It's because right. people are saying bozo a ton in 2021. Oh, yeah. All the time. All the time. <laughs> <You> bojo! <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to start calling people bojos. <laughs> I want to hear other things that are going to change, but only one letter of it. <laughs> Xenophobia runs as rampant as the ostracized prawns living in this South African slum, where one bigot is slowly turning into a busty country singer with ambitions of taking down the office patriarchy. Okay, got it. Yeah, I got it. <laughs> Uh. <laughs> I love it. It's just I hate I hate that it clicks in so quickly. I think is is what bothers me the most. So, okay. <laughs> Did you get you got it? Yeah. Yeah. All right. Ready? Yeah. District nine to five. <laughs> yeah. yeah. District nine to five. <laughs> dream Why was dream. I so worried? Why was I worried? I'm good at this. District nine to five. Of course it is, some guy, you son of a bitch. <laughs> District nine, nine to five. five. Yeah, baby. District nine to five. Yeah. <laughs> The, the, the two things I know, science fiction movies and Dolly Parton stuff. Stumble out of bed and I got an alien weapon, shooting lots of good. <laughs> yeah, you, man, you're, you're so sci-fi. Good. Honestly, a lot of this is just going to have to be me riffing because I, <laughs> I'm just going to get the answer. Everyone always takes, they're like, uh, they're like all right, and there's an alien the thing is the glowing finger. Okay, is it, is it, is it Beetlejuice? Beetlejuice? <laughs> Is it Juice? Is it the movie Juice and Beetlejuice? District 925! We are stuck on Earth forever! District 925! <laughs> Damn. Yeah, that's great. That's great. These are so easy. We're going to rattle through. 
The cast of a beloved Gene Roddenberry ripoff sees their fictional exploits turn very real when they find themselves in the crosshairs of the amusement park's malfunctioning gunslinger android. Say again, I missed the first part. Yeah, let's hit this again for me, Joe, if you don't mind. What, 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 wait, what, read them again? <laughs> read the whole thing again? Oh! Oh, okay, it switched. The amusement park's malfunctioning gunslinger android. And what was the se second part? When they find themselves in the crosshairs of the, the amusement park's malfunctioning gunslinger android. Okay, so that's Westworld. There's a malfunctioning gunslinger android at an amusement park. I have... This is ringing no bells. You might know it more than you think you do. Do you know what the first one is? Galaxy Quest. Quest. Does it start with the word quest, Joe? Okay. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I, oh, I got it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Gosh. All right. All right. Ready? Galaxy, Galaxy Quest, Quest World. World. Yeah! <laughs> Galaxy Quest World? Oh, it's yeah, dude! <laughs> <laughs> oh, is it, is it a movie? It is, it was a movie first. Okay, yeah, Galaxy Quest World. Yeah! Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> I had yeah. it in my head, but I couldn't figure out. I was like, Galaxy Quest World? Yes! Holy wow. crap! Wow! <laughs> Galaxy Quest World? Yeah, damn it, you got it! Yeah! What? I had no idea that was a movie! <laughs> all right, all right, it's too easy for you guys. You sons of bitches. You damn smart. <laughs> These are great. They're movies. great, Joe. I, Listen, we're, just, we're disappointed in ourselves. Yeah, I never know if we should be proud or ashamed that we get Shame. things as quickly as we do. <laughs> <It's> <laughs> It's probably a little bit of both. All right, next one. This la this next one, I'm going to know it immediately, but I'm going to draw it out for the viewers. I'll be interested to know if you know it. Well, you probably will, because you, you obviously just got that cinema knowledge. Rico and the Roughnecks mow down swarms of giant murder insects controlled by a vagina-faced brain bug, spending sleepless nights with his son inside a small room at the train station while overcoming homelessness and financial struggles. This is hard. At the train station? Oh, wait. Yeah, I, I know the it. second one. Yeah, I got it. The first Ugh. one. Ugh. Okay, because I know that Rico and the Roughnecks is a dead giveaway. I know it's a dead giveaway. I don't know the Rico. The I don't know Rico and the Roughnecks. Rico, Rico and the Roughnecks? What? You, oh, do we need to, we're just going to confer real quick. Tell me, tell me what it is. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I immediately am I'm thinking of alien monster movies. Yes. Right? Which is yes. alien, yes. aliens, all of that sort of thing. Um, the second one is very obvious. It's Pursuit of Happiness. Good so man, really, good man. Really what I'm doing is trying to figure out what would proceed, what alien related movie would proceed, <laughs> would end in purr. Ooh, trooper, I had trooper Oopers, purrs. <laughs> I, I, I know the second part, I don't know the first one. You want me to do the first one? Give you me can... a clue, give me a clue to like somebody who's in it or something. So, I gotta go with, okay, there's a movie where there's a bunch of people murdering a bunch of insects, right? Um, and they're mowing them down and they're taking them down and there's like a vagina at the end of it. Like, and we see vaginas <laughs> everywhere, right? So like, it wasn't until Wild Things that Denise Richard came so close to a vagina oh. again. <laughs> <laughs> oh. But what is this movie called? So I have to go, what are the space movies where people shoot a bunch of aliens uh -huh. uh, and, and then one of the bigger aliens looks like a vagina, right? Uh -huh. So I go, oh, space movies. They're Star Wars, they shoot things. Uh -huh. What is it? What is Star Wars? Michael Whistler? Ironside, Whistler Whistler isn't it? Whistler 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 Whistler. Yes. In the next letter. Um, but then I went and I looked. And I said, what have I been watching recently? And recently. Um, no way. <laughs> rec <laughs> <laughs> I know it. I know. I got it. I got it. I got it. Okay. And, all right. Okay. Ready? Yeah. Well, hold on. Well, the second one was. I remember the second one. I don't even remember the clue for the second one. Per true person of interest. True person.
True Percy Weasley. I, I I'm on the internet uh, often, and I was I was I, I watch a lot of review videos, like sort of comedic uh -huh. review videos. <laughs> what was what was this? What was I, it's been so long that I can't remember the clue for the second one. I put it all together initially. Oh yeah 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 okay yeah yeah, okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> and one of the review videos I recently watched. One of them was recently on a movie, uh, Starship Troopers. Uh huh. And, and if you look at Starship Troopers, uh -huh. it's a number of guys and girls naked showering mm -hmm. by, by showers. Um, and they fight. They, they fight aliens. And, I, and I'm relatively do. sure that the head alien looks almost like a vagina. And the movie, mm -hmm. the, the title of the movie, ends in Purr, uh, which uh, is how <laughs> Pursuit. Pursuit of happiness starts. So uh -huh. I would almost say, my I guess just <laughs> riffing, my guess would be um, Starship True Pursuit of Happiness. Yeah! <laughs> Dude, look up to the left. You see that scoreboard right there next to you? Yeah, those are the asshole points and they're skyrocketing. Yes! <laughs> I knew it. <laughs> Starship True Pursuit of Happiness with a Y. Yes, it works, kind of. <laughs> oh, Starship, Starship True Pursuit of Happiness. <laughs> Yay! If you're chasing somebody, you might be in pursuit of happiness. True, Starship True Pursuit of Happiness. Yeah, he got it all by himself. Nobody helped him. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Starship True Pursuit of Happiness. <laughs> oh my god, you're on fire! Uh, <laughs> got it. <laughs> I just had to listen to like a like a like a thesis <laughs> for your. I, that was a dissertation. <laughs> god dang it! The other ones were too quick. They were going too mm. quick. So. <laughs> Everybody, thank you so much for watching. Let me know in the comments down below which ones were your favorites. Hit us with your own creations. The at-home card game physical version of this is available for pre-order in the description. Uh, thank you to everybody that supported the Kickstarter. And also in the description are the link to some really cool enamel pins, which are, you know, adorable. Guys, you did it. Perfect. Awesome. You're great. Do the thing. Say the stuff. Where do you want them to go? You can follow us on social media, at Elise Willems. At James Willems. And you can find us on Funhouse. Funhouse for our daily content that we make there. Uh, you can also see us do our own uh, live streams and own funny content at youtube.com slash James Willems stuff. Thank you so much, Joe. Woo! Hell yeah. Uh, my name is Malcolm. I'm on Twitter, Verbal the Rapper, or maybe I'm under Malcolm Barrett. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> and I have albums out, and then I have a show called Going Live with Malcolm with Malcolm. Uh, I think it's on iTunes now, maybe it's not. I don't know, that's not how I make my livelihood. <laughs> that's, that's where the fun is. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I just gotta do whatever, man. Hey, thanks for watching this episode of the Movie Movie Game. I'm Hank Greener, you can find me on Vlogbrothers here on YouTube, or Crash Course or SciShow, or on my TikTok, I guess? I yeah. guess I'm a YouTuber? I guess I'm a YouTuber? And a New York Times bestselling author. Great book, by the way. Thanks.